people, Jennifer Zilliotto. I'm back again for another Style Fix video. And the other day I posted a um, photo of myself wearing the kerchief, uh, the oversized bandana in a kind of kerchief style. And one of you wrote me and asked, I never know how to get mine to look as lovely as yours does. Have you done a video on this? I can watch. And I thought, ah, this is a perfect subject to talk about in this week's Style Fix video. So the truth is, I love wearing silk scarves, and I find I wear them a lot. I feel like they add that sense of interest to an outfit, they really polish off an outfit, they elevate an outfit, they add a sense of interest, color, beauty, sort of I feel like you can never really go wrong with a silk scarf. And even if you're not necessarily doing a silk scarf, but doing the, an oversized bandana, for instance, or just a bandana itself, it's such a great, fun, simple way to change up any look. So as you probably have noticed, I tend to wear my scarves often in this kind of kerchief style. I find it's really comfortable. I like the way it looks. Um, I feel like it really suits me. But you can get so creative when you're tying a scarf and that is a lot of fun. Now I will do a video coming up soon with Manuela Jari from Dora Nola because um, she tends to wear her scarves differently than I do. And it's a lot of fun to explore that with her. But for today's video, I'm just gonna keep it very simple and just talk about how to do the kerchief style. The easiest thing to do is kind of tie it before you're going to wear it because it takes on a different shape. It sort of gets a little bit molded and creases in the right places, if that makes sense. So all you have to do is just slip it on and not think about it. There's nothing worse than feeling like you're fussing all day long with a scarf. That totally defeats the purpose. So with a kerchief style, basically all you're gonna do is fold it in half. And this is one of the bigger sized scarves, as you can see. Um, and then I tend to roll up the edges a little bit so that I make it shorter. And then all I do is where I've rolled it up, I put that on the inside so you have kind of a nice weight and a nice drape and then I just tie it at the back. And then voila, there you go. You can tie it as tight as you want to the neck or as loose as you want. This is a lovely look that creates a lot of drama if you wanna do it quite low. Um, as you can see today with my she, her, I've gone a little bit higher. I really love uh, kerchief style over a crew neck sweatshirt. I feel like it just elevates the sweatshirt so much. And look, I could roll this a lot if I wanted just to make it shorter. And then you have a choice here. So you tie it around and then you have a choice. You can either just tie it at the back, knot it, and leave it, which is really comfortable. And you've got a cute little detail at the back or you can tuck those ends in or if you like, tie it round in the front. I guess I should take my other scarf off so you can see this better, but so comfortable. And there you go. And I loosely tied it underneath there. I like to show a little bit of neck just so that you have some length. I feel like it's quite important. Otherwise it tends to feel a little bit too stuffed, stuffy. There's another style that I really like that I wanna show you. That's simple, same sort of idea. Hang on, I'm gonna take this other scarf off. So same kind of idea where we roll all that extra up. You can go closer to the neck, although again, I'm pulling it down slightly just to give myself a little bit of breathing room. I don't like the way it feels, but some people might. Um, I just think it looks a little bit better when you have a little bit of more skin showing, just it gives you some length. And then if you want, you can just give it a little bit of a tie in the front. And this is a really, really cute look too. This can get tucked in 
as well, or if you're wearing more of a cowl neck type sweater, that can get tucked in and feels really, really good because it sort of um, protects your neck from that scratchy, wooly feeling. Otherwise, if you want to do like I showed in my photo the other day, same idea, take this basic shape, flip it onto the back, and then just put a tie in the front. And again, leave my skin a little bit of breathing room. This is a really, really cute look, especially I find in the summertime, if you wanna dress up a white t-shirt or a white dress shirt or a white linen shirt, this is a really nice kind of look or just like a basic kind of crew neck um, t-shirt dress. And another really, really simple way to do this without fussing is to use a simple scarf ring. Here's one of the Doranola scarf rings. This one is the gold, and all I'm gonna do is take my two ends, slip it in, and that is it. And I don't need to touch it, I don't need to knot it. It keeps it really fresh so that if I wanna wear it in a different way the following day, it's not all wrinkled like it would be if it was tied. And that is basically it, my friends. Very simple little tutorial, how to style a silk scarf in the kerchief style. Very simple, hope you liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. Press that notification bell so that you know when I've uploaded another video. And of course, for more style ideas and more inspiration, you can continue to follow me on Facebook and on Instagram.